Welcome back. Today it's time to talk about trolling. People participate in trolling when they want to make people mad and get a reaction out of people. How trolling works is that you go online and you say something controversial, maybe something kind of hateful, maybe something that you just know is going to make people angry. And the idea is that people will then comment back at you. You have said something that has made them angry, and because they're angry, now lots of people are talking. Trolling can be extremely profitable. If you own a website, you want people having these kinds of conversations. The more people comment, the more they share the link, the more people who are going to comment again, and the more shares, and so on and so forth, until you've got millions of shares and millions of viewers to your website. That's what trolling is. Now, why do people choose to troll? If you're not getting paid to troll, why would you want to troll? Trolls will often participate in online communities not to make any money at all, but to simply stir the pot. If you're playing an online game, sometimes a troll will join the game. They will intentionally lose the game and maybe be abusive and maybe harass other players. Sometimes in online communities, people will say racist, sexist, or, or hateful things simply because they, they want to watch people be angry. Uh, they'll often quote the Batman line, some people just want to watch the world burn, as if that's something poignant and clever. Another common thing I hear from people who participate in trolling is that they want to call out people on their hypocrisy. I'm gonna show them that they're hypocrites. I think there's an idea that trolling, it's just words. Words can't hurt anybody. Sticks and stones can break my bones, but words can never hurt me, so, like, who cares? I'm just using words. I don't really mean it. I'm just saying it. It's just, it's my online persona, but that's not really what I think. And, you know, I'm, I'm still a decent person just because I said a bad thing, whatever. The problem with this with all of these arguments is that they kind of, they're, they're not very good arguments. The thing is, words can be hurtful. In fact, we've all been hurt by words, and many, many words are very, very hurtful. And if you are going around saying hurtful things and hurting people with your words, you are incorrect about your assessment of yourself as a nice person if you're saying terrible things. We all have two identities. There's our internal identity and our external identity. I think of myself one way, but the world thinks of me a totally different way. If I like myself and the rest of the world doesn't like me, am I wrong or is the rest of the world wrong? The rest of the world can be wrong. People judging you are not necessarily right. There's lots and lots of times when people judging you are totally incorrect and, and you need to stand up for yourself and, and stand up for who you are and who you, who you believe you are. But the problem here is that you also have to recognize that what other people think of you does matter. If all you ever put out in the world is crud, then you're being kind of cruddy. You can't really say, I troll, but I'm not a troll. Once you start trolling, you're now a troll. And by extension, you can't say, I say hateful things online, but I'm not a hateful person. Once you start putting that out in the world, that becomes your identity. I think we're living in a moment that has made it pretty clear that trolling does have an impact, and it's not a good one. The thing about trolling is that usually it's trying to get at those things that people care most about. And the things that people care most about tend to be human rights. And so if you're walking around trolling saying, oh, those particular people don't deserve human rights, and more and more and more people are saying that, that means more and more and more people are starting to give credence to the idea that there are particular human beings that do not deserve rights. And if you're contributing to that, like, you're part of a much, much larger problem, and I'd really, really ask you to think about that. Do you really not believe that particular people deserve to have the same rights as other people? Why? If you don't have a good reason for feeling that way, I would ask that you kind of learn a little bit more about why you think that, and, and why other people don't think that, and, and really probe your reasons for believing that, because taking away people's rights is kind of like taking away their humanity, and if we cannot see the humanity in one another, we are going to live in a very, very unpleasant world. 
And so if you want to try to make this world a slightly better place, I'd really encourage you to think about the kind of things you say online. And please, please, don't post that troll post. It's not funny. Thanks.